Hi everyone. In this series of videos we're looking at how to use the Avada Builder elements. Today we're looking at how to use the Section Separator element. Make sure you subscribe to our YouTube channel to keep up with all the latest videos like this one. And if you don't want to miss one, click the bell icon to get notifications of all new videos on our channel. OK, let's begin. The Section Separator element allows you to separate sections in your site with style. As of Avada 7.2, it now comes with 20 different styles to choose from, and can add a lot of flair to your design. If we look here on the home page of the new Classic demo, we can see the section separator in action. This is the Waves Opacity style. Let's have a look at how this element is used. If I edit the top container here and head to the Background tab, we can see it has a normal background image. Inside this container there is a 1-1 column with a title, a text block, and a button. And at the very bottom of this column is the Section Separator element. It's important with this element that the container does not have any padding at the bottom, and that the column does not have any padding or margin at the bottom. If I just adjust those area with the drag handles, you can see what happens when I add some bottom padding to the container, or any padding or margins to the column. In each case, the container background image shows through, and ruins the effect. OK, once our container and columns are set, let's look at the actual element options. The first option is the Section Separator Style. As mentioned, there are now 20 styles to choose from. These are Triangle, Slant, Big Triangle, Rounded Split, Curved, Big Half Circle, Clouds, Horizon, Waves, Waves Opacity, a new one called Waves Brush, Hills, Hills Opacity, and the other new ones, Grunge, Music, Paper, Squares, Circles, Paint, and Grass. With each style comes a unique range of options for positioning and style. For example, if we look at this particular style, we have a height option to control how high the separator is, and if we change this to 250 pixels, for example, we can see the overall height of the separator is reduced. Following this, we can see that the horizontal position of the separator is set to the left. We could change this to the right if we wanted to flip the separator horizontally, like this. The vertical position of the separator aligns the vertical position to the bottom or the top, which effectively flips the effect vertically, which would not work when the separator section is at the bottom of the column as it is here. At the bottom of this tab is the Element Visibility option, which allows you to show or hide the element on various screen sizes, and the CSS Class and CSS ID fields for further CSS customization. If we then move to the Design tab, we can see a couple more options. There is a Margin option for the element, and a Background Color option. This is what allows you to blend the separator into the next container. Because the next container is white, setting this to white here blends it in seamlessly. Each different style has different option sets, depending on the style. Some styles can flip both vertically and horizontally, while others only flip vertically and some don't have any positioning options at all. Uniquely, the triangle style allows you to set an icon and icon color, as well as a border and border color. And finally, all of the new styles added in 7.2 also have a repeat option, for controlling how many times the separator should repeat horizontally. Take the time to experiment with the styles to find the one that looks best for your circumstance. And of course, these can just as easily go on the top of containers as well as the bottom. OK, this concludes our video on how to use the Section Separator element. Make sure you subscribe to our YouTube channel to keep up with all the latest videos. And if you have any questions or need assistance, please create a support ticket and our team will gladly assist you. As always, we want to thank you for choosing Avada.